how we're starting it. Um, it's a pretty busy day. That's how we're starting it. Okay. It's a pretty busy day today. We have, uh, we teach agility. Kale, how many agility classes do you have? Uh, three in the daytime and then I have a break and then three in the evening. Um, and then today I'm teaching a private lesson midday as well. So it's going to be, uh, it's going to be a busy day and uh, a lot of time spent in our arena, which really isn't a bad day. No, it's true. I have to teach agility. Then I have a meeting and then we've got to film a video for the YouTube channel. Uh, and then I teach obedience tonight, so uh, we better get started. Yeah, it's a long day. So I just finished my second class, and uh, one thing that's fun about the class is my mother, who's holding onto the camera right now, by the way, uh, and Purple are in the class, and uh, it was really fun today because she actually has a broken leg, which is not the fun part, but she was, <laughs> she was able to do the sequence uh, just by sending her dog. Um, actually, now that I'm thinking back, it was really stupid for me not to get video of that, Mom. It was stupid. <laughs> Anyways, um, I've been into like crafting lately, just ever since Slice died, I've been trying to like keep myself busy. So I I actually made these really cool beaded collars um, for my dogs and I knew my mom, oh she's licking it, I knew my mom would appreciate it so I made one here, I think her name might be upside down, um, I made one here that uh, has purple on it, here Perk, come here, get to put your collar on, so hopefully it fits, oh it does, it looks beautiful little purple, yes good girl, now purple is a, I have a soft spot for purple because she's actually my puppy's mother, um, she uh, is, uh, reminds me of Beeline every single day, I guess I should say the other way, other way around, Beeline reminds me of purple and after having purple for a week, it is crazy how genetics work and how similar these two are, it's, uh, it's pretty dreadful. So I just finished my private lessons and my classes for this afternoon and I have uh, a few hours off before I have to come back and teach again. And I'll have to say one of the best things about being a professional dog trainer is the fact that I get to bring my dogs to work and have an opportunity to exercise them and hang out with them or train them in between um, when I'm teaching. Um, today though, I think I'm gonna head home for a couple hours. Um, my little sister is actually getting married in September, which is really exciting. And I am the maid of honor and what makes this wedding even more uh, exciting is that the wedding is actually here on a property. Um, they're actually going to be getting married just behind me actually um, towards this uh, area behind me there that's um, where they're going to actually have the, the ceremony um, which is great so um, we have a lot of work to do and uh, we are planning a stag and doe which is also located here um, in August so I have a little bit of organization to do uh, for that so hopefully I can get a little bit done on that uh, this afternoon and then be back here to teach tonight. And then tonight, I have a level two class that I teach, um, where we do like teaching the obstacles, all the contacts, weaves, and basic handling, things like that. All the dogs that have just come up from the foundation class. Um, and then foundation class after that. And uh, again, I'm a lucky duck because I get to take the class with B, um, with Beeline. And then the last class of the night is uh, my level five international class. And um, <laughs> they're, um, fun and sometimes rowdy group of students so uh, and then I get to compliment the night by teaching with uh, my bestie Jamie so yeah Tuesdays are pretty good super busy but uh, pretty good
we have a meeting today <clears throat> and I teach agility. We have the meeting at 11. I teach agil agility until 10, so I've got to make my way over as quickly as possible. Hopefully I'm not too late. So I am a little bit late. And this is our crew. Here's Ken late to the meeting. <laughs> <laughs> the meeting has started. <laughs> so this is, uh, this is Marty. Hello. Have a great shot Hello. out there. Hi, everybody. And Simon. <laughs> I can't oh. see if, whether I can see Simon. Yep. There you I think is. Simon can be seen. Yep. Back to work. The way we go, classes uh, have just begun. We've got to yep. organize the, uh, this is one of the more challenging parts, is breaking down the time. Sadly, I need to use my calculator every single time because I don't want anybody to get uneven time. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. This is the only class that Ken and I get to teach together in a week. Actually, no. We have two now. Can you help me tonight? No, two. Oh, that's right. Mm -hmm. I forgot about that. So glad he remembered on week two. Yeah. <laughs> Busy day so far, so I, I've just jumped back in my truck. I'm gonna head home. I need to. We need to shoot a video, a training video for the channel. Uh, I need to take the dogs out for a run. It's a beautiful day outside, so I need to get everybody outside and uh, do something fun with them. And then it's, I'll have to have dinner before I go back to the to the hall. So at this point, I'm cutting it pretty close. I, but I do enjoy being busy. So hopefully, it's uh, this doesn't uh, run me ragged. But so far, so good. Off to the next uh, task for the day. The end of another really busy day, but it was uh, really productive. I know Kale had a great time in class with her border collie. Yes, I had a great class with uh, Beeline tonight. She was uh, she was great with her agility skills, but I think our big breakthrough of the night is uh, that she was able to like lie down and wait her turn between exercises, completely off leash, totally relaxed, and not like eyes bulging out of her head and like brain buzzing. Mm -hmm. um, she gets a little bit overstimulated with all the action, but she's really like turned a corner in the last month or so and, and started to like relax a little bit and be able to wait her turn. And that was like really exciting for me. Yeah. Even though it wasn't that big of a deal, maybe to some people, but to me that's like, that's like a big, big step in the right direction. Yeah. And if I look like I'm holding myself really weird, I did like a bajillion blind crosses last night and I pulled the muscles in my neck and now I can't turn to the left. So we should have sat on opposite directions. Or I can sit over here. Opposite sides. Now I can't down. see you at all. I know. Anyways, I I'm sorry I look like easily. a big geek right now, but it's a little bit stiff. Um, this is your first time with us, make sure you hit that subscribe button. There's a little bell beside the subscribe button so that um, if you click that bell and uh, allow yourself to be notified every time we upload a video, uh, YouTube will let you know. Um, on that note, uh, I think we're going to shut the lights out on this place. So, uh, happy training and bye for now. See ya.